Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. Today I have a video all about websites. So this is something that I do not shy away from. Having a website is a really important part of building a personal brand, which is also extremely important to marketing yourself as a freelancer or as a content creator. And I think this is also something that's really gonna be helpful for some of you who ask me questions like, what can I do to freelance besides just social media management? Or how can I upsell for my social media management clients? So one of the things that I do offer is websites. And this is a really nice way to ease into that for a lot of clients that maybe need something up really, really quickly or clients that don't need a super complex website design. So I'm excited to share with you this tool that I recently discovered. And I wanna thank Bookmark for partnering with me on today's video. This is a very unique web design service that uses AI to actually pretty much build a website for you that is fully customizable and that's actually free to sign up for. So like I said, adding this onto your services is a great option for people who are starting out as social media managers or any other type of digital marketing consultants or anything like that. You just start now, obviously, in the right corner here. You sign up, it's free to create a bookmark account. You can sign up with Facebook or Google. I'm just gonna sign up with my email address. Then you go ahead and click start now and you're going to just answer seven quick questions that is gonna help this AI, they call it Ada, uh, help you to figure out exactly what you need on your website. So there we go, social media marketing right there. There's photographers, coffee shop, I mean, these are really um, specific, which is awesome because they are so customized already. You'll see once, once this gets into it, just how customized these are. But just for the sake of the video, I'm gonna choose social media marketing. I'm gonna make myself a second um, personal website. Enter your name, easy enough. Do we want e-commerce or a blog? So these are two features that are available on Bookmark. I'm just gonna say, I'll say yes to e-commerce, no to a blog. Okay, then it's gonna make sure that I'm not any of these people because it looks like some of these people are already using Bookmark. Obviously that's not me. So go ahead and click next. And then you can fill all of this stuff out. I'm just gonna add a picture instead of a logo. You can add your phone number, your email, your address. All of this stuff can be customized afterwards too. So if you don't need any of that right away, that's okay. And then you can go through, take a look at the different page layouts. Is there any preference that you have? If not, uh, Bookmark is going to select which one they think is best for you. I like this look. I think it's really modern. The, actually I want a single page website, just something simple, you know? And then it's gonna ask you to select some of these images that you like just to get a feel for your style. Um, I like a really clean, ooh, I like that flamingo that's cute so i ask you to choose at least two i choose four i have a hard time picking <laughs> and then what's your website style bright fresh clean bold modern or sophisticated oh this one is tough i want something different from what i have right now which is just very simple modern clean so i'm gonna go with bright let's do it and then you just wait 30 seconds or so and let's see what it comes up with for me all right so they're telling me that my website is ready so got it so you can take a look at what they've come up with for me. And you can decide if you're satisfied with that and you wanna go ahead and start editing the website or if you'd like to create a new website. I can have Ada go back to the drawing board and create something new for me, but I honestly like this. There are a couple of little customizations that I'd probably make, but I like the layout of this and the look of it. So I'm gonna go ahead and click start editing this website. So the great thing is this wizard does pop up and helps you out a ton with getting all your edits made. I can learn how to change website fonts. So this is actually something that I definitely do want to do. I'm not a fan of this kind of like, I don't know what you call that, the sans serif kind of bubbly type font. I really like a more kind of sophisticated sleek font. So that's something that I'm definitely going to do. So to change your website font, select the design tab and then choose text title fonts. Pretty easy, right? text title fonts all right oh this is cool it actually has font pairings so i can make sure that they look good together so let's see i like this one railway and roboto okay i'm gonna keep that one in mind i like this one it's a little easier to read so then you can also click advanced here to use your own font which is cool and then i can also change the menu font if i wanted but that's fine for now so go back cool let's see what else we can change i can customize the website sections so all we gotta do here is click on the focus in the menu and then click on add, delete, 
or rearrange to rearrange how this is set up. So honestly, I do like how this is set up. It kind of has like your welcome button, your let's chat, your vision, your product gallery. I'm probably gonna remove this because I don't really need that. So I'll go ahead and just remove these. You can see how easy it is by just clicking on the X to remove any sections of the website. I can also drag things around. So let's say that I don't want this to be at the footer. I kind of want this to be in the middle of the page. So you can just grab those little gray, almost perforated looking sections and drag them up to get these to move around, which is really nice. Move that. And you can do that for pretty much any of these sections. Let's say that I want the social handles for my staff to go above their little bio. I can just drag that right up. Oops, there we go. If you mess anything up, like I did a weird space there, I dragged a spacer there on accident. You can just click on undo and it'll remove what you did and take things back to normal. And then again, editing, let's say I'll put myself first because I'm the founder of the company, Tasha James founder super easy to edit text you can also change like if i wanted founder my title to be in italics if i wanted to add a link here if i wanted to change the the size of it so i think that looks pretty good it looks a little odd to have it the same size as my name so i just made that a little smaller that looks really nice and you can change these images as well. Of course, these are kind of just your stock images. That's not me, obviously. So you just click on change image, you'll hover, hover over it. And there are all of these great images that you can use for free that Bookmark provides you, which is really nice. Of course, for like background images and things like that, but since this is my own image, you can just go back and use, this is an image I already uploaded to myself, or you can click on new and upload a file if I wanted something different. So there we go. And then if we go back here to the module section, it's really easy also to add different elements to the website that aren't automatically put in there by Ada. So I can add a gallery, I can add a video. Let's add a video because I have a lot of video content. So you just grab it, drag it. Let's do it actually, let's not do it here because there's a video playing in the background. Let's do it like here. Okay, and then all you gotta do is add the YouTube URL. Enter it in, click save, and then you have this nice full-size video. So then whenever you're satisfied, let's just pretend that I filled in all of this information here, I've gotten everything set up. I just click on save to make sure that, you know, I don't lose all my hard work. And then you can go ahead and click preview to see what your website looks like in action. And you can kind of click around, you can just go ahead and play that video right in the website, which is great. I love how these things kind of move around. It's just really, it's really a good little tool here. And then whenever you're satisfied, you just click on publish. So another great thing that I love about Bookmark is that not only can you build a fully functioning website in about two minutes and just answering seven questions or so, but it's also fully responsive on mobile, which is so important. Having a mobile optimized website is like the number one thing that I recommend to people who are looking to build because people are looking on their phones now. Nobody is looking at websites on desktop. Not nobody, but most people are looking at websites on their phones now. So it's cool too, because you can go over here and actually see what your website looks like looks like on mobile, which I love. Let's scroll down a bit. Actually it looks really nice. I almost like it better on mobile. Ooh, that's nice. Very nice. And same with the tablet. A lot of people are on their tablets as well. So you can see what that looks like as well. Super important. And it's just really nice uh, for, like I said, just when you need something up quick or when you need a simple website, it's totally free to sign up. You can connect your domain for an additional charge here, but it is free to start with and you get some really great features. So definitely recommend checking it out. I'm going to have a link in the description box where you can go ahead and play around with this tool, sign up for yourself. Like I said, it's free to sign up, so it doesn't hurt to give it a shot. And I'd love to hear what you guys think about this in the comments. So please comment down below. Let me know what you think. Think. Again, I want to thank Bookmark for partnering with me on today's video, and I hope that this inspired you a little bit to expand some of your services offerings if you are a freelance social media manager, or I hope this inspired you to go ahead and build your own website if you've been thinking about it. It's honestly easier than you think, and it's, it's easier now than ever with a tool like this. Anyway, have a link for that down below, and thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe, thumbs up, all that stuff, and check out Bookmark. All right, I'll talk to you next time. Bye.